It appears Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim owner Artie Moreno has gotten what every baseball owner would like to have in the stadium game. Two communities wanting his baseball property. All of a sudden, Long Beach, California, which is about 23 miles from Anaheim, is offering Moreno a chance to explore the city's waterfront area for a stadium. There's no concrete proposal for a Long Beach stadium. There's no money plan, just the notion that Moreno could be in a position to develop the waterfront property with the stadium as the centerpiece. Moreno is also negotiating with Anaheim officials. The deal to use the Anaheim Stadium between Marino and the city ends after the 2020 baseball season. Anaheim officials expect to hear from Marino and his partners in two to four months with a new stadium or rebuilding plan. Long Beach, more than a half century ago, was in the running to get the Los Angeles Angels franchise's then-owner. Gene Autry was looking to move out of Dodger Stadium and for a place of his own. In 1964, he found the place in Anaheim near Disneyland. In 1966, Archery moved his team to a community that once featured orange groves and being part of a Jack Benny comedy skit featuring Mel Blanc as a train conductor announcing stops in Anaheim, Azusa, and Cucamonga. Anaheim was also the home of the Los Angeles Rams National Football League franchise between 1980 and 1994. Georgia Frontieri took the NFL team to St. Louis in 1995. Anaheim downsized the stadium after the city council could not get a team to replace the NFL Rams. In the past, Marino has looked at sites in Los Angeles, Carson, Irvine, and Tustin. Marino's business is not in despair. He has enjoyed 16 consecutive years of drawing 3 million or more customers. I'm Evan Weiner for The Politics of sports business.